Welcome back to Wolfenstein, the old blood. Got a couple commanders in here, so let's be careful. Didn't shoot. Ah, fuck. All right then. All right, where's that damn commander? Probably up here, huh? Somewhere over in that direction. shoot the backpack on that one that had that electric thing on its backpack? Is that why it ex why they exploded? <laughs> okay. We're good. one did I get? Kill three? I killed three enemies with that grenade? Increases the amount of grenades you can carry by two. Nice. I think that's it. You know, I really like the music in the old blood. Not that I didn't like it in the new order, but I, I don't know, maybe... I guess I just feel like most of the time I couldn't even really hear it very much in the new order. I remember I talked about how the audio mixing when it comes to the music and everything else was weird in the new order. It seems to be a lot more balanced here. I don't know if that's because this game actually is just designed differently when it comes to the uh, the audio balancing or perhaps it's because my new computer perhaps maybe I was experiencing a bug before on my old computer when it comes to the audio and this computer doesn't have it. I have no idea. I wonder if that explodes. I think the red crosshair tells me, yes. Yes, it does. Just like looking around this castle, so many neat things. <laughs> it's funny just to have an, an ancient castle and then there's just a little board here. Like a chalkboard. It looks like a chalkboard anyway. I know it's not being used like that. Gotta be secrets around here. Ooh. Secret view. Chandelier wobbles a little bit. Article, Normandy Defense Museum to open next week. Paris, March 15th, 1946. Two years after the failed Allied invasion of Normandy in June 1944, the war marched in cooperation with the People's Front is ready to inaugurate the first Normandy Defense Museum. 
Spread out on three beaches, the museum is connected by an underground metro and will feature tours of the bunkers, encampments, and the beaches themselves. 156,000 Allied soldiers died during the attempted invasion of Normandy. Only 89 German heroes lost their lives. The failed invasion was subsequently dubbed D-Day by the Allied aggressors, where the D stands for the English word for death, and is perceived by many to be the final nail in the coffin for the already strained Anglo-American alliance. When asked about the speed of which the museum was built, the chief of the museum remarked, It's poetic justice. The museum was built by the enemies we captured during the invasion. They came here to destroy our fatherland, but ended up building a monument to their own defeat. Oh, that's cruel. Hmm. That's teasing me that there's a secret down there. Gold. The question is, how do I get there? Oh! Here we go. Yeah, so it's just over there. Like, down there. Underneath the floor. Looking around here, and I found this. Ah, it opens. Door does not open from this side. In the words of Dark Souls. <clears throat> ah, we got a scope. I don't know why there's a tutorial for it. I mean. Oh, you can switch the scope on and off? Okay. I don't know why you'd want to do that. Oh, shit. I guess they want me to use it right now. But yeah, that's cool. I was thinking I would actually take the scope off, but... No, it just kind of flips to the side. Surprisingly high-tech for a gun that doesn't look particularly high-tech. Above that area that I was at before, remember I tried to get in there? Okay, one more. So this is all building up to getting through that door, huh? I need to use the the comp pistol more. King Otto. Wait, so... Where do I go now? I don't get back on the boat, right? I'm still trying to open this thing, which means I need to use the other lever, which is... Up there, I assume? Yeah. But what exactly have I unlocked? I mean, this still isn't unlocked, so... Where do I go now? There's something I could do in here? So, I'm coming from over there. I think our boat originally came from that direction? Off in that way? 
So I don't think I've been this way. Looks like it's uh, collapsed. Uh, I don't know if it's just extras or if this is actually going to lead somewhere. Ooh. Oh yeah, this might be it. Yeah, it is it. Should I do it? Should I use it for once? That's the only time I'm going to use it in the whole game. You probably won't die in one hit. But maybe in multiple. Oh, that was loud. <laughs> that was really loud. Well, I don't see any commanders nearby, so... Actually, this would be a perfect time for... Shockhammer. A heavy and powerful double-barreled semi-automatic combat shotgun. Holy shit. Fire some alternating barrels for increased rate of fire. Oh my god. Double... wait. I don't understand the significance of the double barrel. It's double-barreled, but it has alternating barrels? Like, what? So can you shoot it more than twice before you have to reload it? I'll check that in a second. First, we must educate ourselves. Never mind, that's not a note, that's a map. I thought I heard a noise. Like something grinded open. What was that? Is it this? Ah, anyway. Yeah, it says double barrel, but look, it holds 10 shots per drum, I guess. Does it... I don't... What? I thought the significance of a double barrel shotgun is that it holds two shells at one time. You load one into each barrel. This one has two barrels, but you only shoot one shot at each time, and... You can hold 10 shots per drum. What? Why does it even have two barrels? What's the point? That is very strange. There's no, like, fire both barrels at the same time. You can only fire one. Huh. Don't get me wrong, it's cool, I just don't understand. Should 
open the way into the keep. Jesus, what happened to my health? Okay, try number two. Alright, uh, I'd like to hit them with some explosives before they spread out too much, so let's get this thing ready. This plus sniper would be good to switch between. Jesus. Stop throwing grenades. Yeah, so these heavily armored opponents, I don't think they die in one hit um, from the body, when shot in the body with this rifle. making this very ominous. I'm definitely going to get trapped in here. Still, right, I still need to find Wesley. gross and also kind of cool, so it's a multi-stage thing.
I'm gonna go to just one assault rifle so I can run faster. Not this again. Fuck that pile of meat. I'm so close to dead. Let's get some armor. Don't throw that grenade. I think the fire burns. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, it burns. I think I'm going back to two assault rifles. Oh, Jesus! I guess I didn't kill him, or there's another one right next to him. Let's try that again. Please tell me there's a checkpoint there. Yeah, good. Looks like always couple ones close to you or they will throw grenades.
I like how the alarm stops when they all die, as if someone's just monitoring the situation. Someone's just overseeing the whole thing. It's like, mm, they all died. Alright, you can turn the alarm off. I like this one better. Shit, I've been torturing for hours. Damn it. And we're good. Mm. Yeah, let's go with the dual weapons on both. Look at all these pathways to go up and down, and I think there might be a secret over there. A little super highways on top of all the barrels. Oh, is that where I'm supposed to go? I think I just gotta jump. Ooh! Shit. Eh, let's loot down here. I wonder if any of this stuff is destructible. Whoops. I think that's it. Sorry, doggy. Where does this go, though? Oh, locked door. It's a little, uh, what is that called? A Coco Demon? Plush? Oh, 
Alas, poor Yurik. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> what was that? Oh, Jaeger's room. Uh, are they wiping their ass with money? I was just curious if it would do anything. I mean it, no harm. They're cute. Ingrid's letter. Oh. Rudy, my sweet boy. I wish you could have taken the time to... Uh, how do I scroll down this thing? What the hell? Can't use the scroll wheel. Rudy, my sweet boy, I wish you could have taken the time to visit your poor old mother this Christmas. Maybe you were busy. What do I know? When you were little, you were such a good boy. Such a good son. I honestly feel, and maybe I should have told you this, that I was blessed to have had you in my life. I know your father could be cruel, very cruel, to you sometimes. But that's all in the past now, isn't it? Best not to dwell on such things. And besides, I was always there to nurse your wounds, to stave off infections. So I think it's unfair of you to blame me for what he did. What the fuck? You know, he only meant to correct you, and sometimes, frankly, it was all in his right to do so. While you were a good son most of the time, you could also be very, very bad when that dark mood fell upon you. I'm sure you understand why your father had to use his belt. My dear boy, you know how I fell upon hard times after your father died, and I had to send you away to your cousins in Frankfurt. Well, now that you are so successful with the SS, I was thinking you could send me some money. Uh, I'm not asking for much, my dear, but it would ease the pain that comes with growing old alone. Your loving mother, Ingrid. Mother of the year. Helga's Diary, Entry 4, December. My god, how it's snowing outside. The stone corridors of this castle are freezing cold. Have to wear thick, warm socks every day. They're comfortable, but a terrible itch sets in after a while. Got back the translation of another passage from King Otto's Diary today. Very interesting. The king is grief-stricken after his wife, Queen Eadgith, died unexpectedly. He goes on to write about ancient fragments of parchments that have come in his possession. He has put his most prominent scholars on the task of deciphering them. Despite not knowing their contents, he believes them to be a gift from God, and that the Lord is telling him his destiny is to become the Holy Emperor of Europe. Puzzling. They must have looked really special, these parchments. Or maybe it's the grief taking over, blinding him. Anyway, went to the wine cellar earlier today. Found a 1928 Bordeaux. A very good year, I've heard. Time to taste. Oh, I see you. Really? Oh, looks like we just got a checkpoint. Starting a whole new scene with two commanders. Alright, I think I'll end this episode here, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.